Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So in this video I will show you how you can install and use Microsoft PowerShell on Linux. So are you ready? Let's get started. So as you may know PowerShell is actually a terminal application for Windows system. It can also be used as the command line interface and scripting language for Windows and it's based on the .NET framework so you can now install it even if it's Microsoft product under any distribution of Linux so here I'm on CentOS so the first thing is I have to register the Microsoft repository so in order to do that I go to my terminal and I tap this command here so you can use curl or you can use wget in order to register the Microsoft repository okay so after that you can simply install PowerShell using the command or the package manager yum so I will use yum install PowerShell okay so I hit enter so now the package will be actually downloaded so as you can see here it came from Microsoft okay so here it's about the total download size is about 50 megabytes so I will hit yes in order to install it So now the packages are being downloaded so it depends on your connection it will take some time and here I will also say yes for importing GPG key, keys and now the packages will be installed okay now everything is complete so I can just then type PowerShell in order to get the command line interface so and now you can execute PowerShell using the command PW shell so as you can see here it's PowerShell version 6.1 it's preview.2 okay so it's from Microsoft Corporation so now you are on command line interface of PowerShell so you can use all the famous commands from PowerShell so for example you can use get command in order to get a list of all commands used by PowerShell okay so as you can see here there are quite a lot of commands that you can use okay It provides you also with the common commands that you can use under Linux. For example, pwt print working directory here. So here I'm on my root directory actually. Also the list command which lists all the content of this directory here. Okay. Also, you can use uh, some uh, famous commands like, like get uh, child item, which actually lists the content of any directory. So, if you provide any directory, for example, home, I mean uh, desktop, for example, so you can see all the content of this directory using the command get child item okay you can create any file if you want with the command new item okay so for example let's create file text file called test.txt here we go the file has been created you can get all the processes that are that are running on your machine with the command get 
process okay so here you see all the processes that are running on my machine okay so it's full of commands that you can use in order to get actually some information about your system okay and of course if you want to return back to your shell you execute the command exit okay so here we go so that was just a brief introduction how you can use PowerShell and their Linux as always I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye-bye.